Okay, so let's start the challenge. Blame game, this is a general skills uh, challenge and it is part of the Git series of challenges for for this year's for this year's general skills challenges. So someone's commits seem to be preventing the program from working. Who is it? You can download the challenge files here. Okay, so we have a link that we can uh, that we can use to, to download the uh, the Git repository, and I'll leave that in the chat as well. But uh, how you would do it inside of the web shell? Let me get out of here. So you can exit from Nano by using Control X to get out of there, uh, and we'll just go into our what was this challenge called again? It was called Blame Game. Okay, so let's go into our Blame Game directory. So inside of Blame Game, I'm going to create a temporary directory just so we can work inside of that. Okay, I need to go into the temp directory. Sorry about that. Okay, so we're gonna download it again. And then we're going to unzip the file. So this unzips a zip repository, and uh, we'll need, we're going to need to move into the drop-in directory in order to access the git repository. So we cd into drop-in, and from here we can we can use all of our git commands. So let's see what's in this directory. So there's a message.py Python file. So we can we can cap that out message.py. And this is this is an incomplete Python statement, so this is not going to run because uh, because there's no there's no um, closing bracket over here. So what we need to do is we need to find out where this all went wrong. Let me take a look at my notes. So this is general blame game. Okay, so. What we can do inside of the Git program. So Git is a collaborative, a collaborative uh, development uh, software. So what we can do is we we can uh, git log, do the git log command in order to get the um, the past commits, and we can also grep for a particular message. And in this case, it's going to be print. Hello world. And this is Yeah, so it was just like this. And then we can do we can search inside of message.py. No wait. Okay, so we can just uh, we can just grep for this. So we grep for this message and we'll try to find this inside of the log. Huh, it seems that if I've done something incorrect. But uh, the manual way of doing this is to do the git log, which shows all of the um, which shows all of the commits over here. And you can scroll all the way to the bottom, which is kind of tedious. And all all the way at the uh, at the beginning of the um, of the history for this particular repository, it'll show you that uh, first the secret project was created, and then the optimized file size of prod code was uh, was done over here. And this is the commit that uh, that changed that changed the um, that changed the code to where it doesn't work anymore. So this is the flag for this particular challenge. Um, we can use this and submit it over at the challenge window over here inside of the uh, this field right here. We can click on submit flag. And if we haven't done so already, we can also click on the thumbs up button over here to rate this positively and to give the challenge makers some love. Hey there, hacker frogs. Are you enjoying this workshop? Learning new concepts and skills? 
If so, there's a way you can support the channel, and it's totally free. Just click on the subscribe button below the video. Also, click on the like button. And if you have questions or comments on this workshop, please leave them below the video. Thanks for listening. And now, back to our scheduled programming.